Well, I just watched the movie The Royal Hotel, written and directed by Kitty Green, and let me tell you, I just wasted an hour and a half of my fucking life. This movie had nothing going on the entire time. They spend the first 30 minutes of the movie setting up where these two Canadian backpackers, Hannah and Liv, are going to be going to in uh, Australia, and then they get to the bar, and in, in the first night, they're like, wow, there's a lot of, you know, misogynistic jokes and sexism going on, and and boy, I don't know if I can handle that at a bar, and then they spend the next 50 minutes of the movie just listening to these men try and make moves on them, sometimes jokingly, sometimes not. But it really creeps them out. And then... <laughs> there's, there's no characters in this movie. Like, there's no arcs. There, there was no reason for me to get behind the main characters in this movie whatsoever. There's no story arc whatsoever. Like, there, there's no tension. There, there's no stakes like each scene just comes and goes. It's like, hello, I'm I'm a scene. Okay, bye bye. That was the scene, and then some shit happens at the end, and they decide to burn the place down and leave that all behind them. And I'm like, um, oh. and they even do the shot where the the place is burning behind them as they walk away like how how fucking corny can you get and uh it's like that there there's nothing to this movie nothing i don't know why why did i watch this it, it was an hour and a half of my life just just gone <coughs> oh my god I guess the movie was supposed to be a realistic portrayal of what bartenders have to go through at bars, but I I mean, to that I say, cool! So let's talk about the things I did like. That being the cinematography and the sound editing. Uh, it's really hard in movies to do, like, club slash bar scenes where there's a bunch of noise and patrons going on at the same time and have you be able to follow everything and this movie does do a good job of that the sound editing is good you're able to follow who is saying what even though there's 40 people in each scene talking and also what i mean by good cinematography is there's you know those 40 people crowded around the camera, but you're able to follow who the main person in the scene is. And that, that that's the only good thing I can say about this movie. And that's why I'm giving this movie 20.222 farks out of a total possible 50.222 farks.